Hi everybody, Coach Dom Costa with another edition of Coaching Bad Youth Coaches Do This. And again, this is just a trip. No matter what, you're going to have parents that do not bring their children on time to your games or contest. And you have probably spent some time doing your lineup, your rotations. You cannot get mad. I have seen coaches actually take it out on the kid and you can't do that. You can't blame the kid. It's not the child's fault. Uh, there might be extenuating circumstances with the family. Something's going on. So don't let it get yourself twisted. Don't let it get you out of your mood. I know you volunteered to coach. You spent a little time to figure out who should bat first, second, third, fourth, fifth, etc. You know what? All you can do is when that child gets there late, put them at the end of the order. Don't punish the child because of you know some other circumstance they can't control. And don't drive yourself nuts. Keep your mood up and coach up your children the best way you can. Especially when you do uh, basketball, because a lot of leagues make you rotate uh, a different five set of players every five minutes of a 10 minute quarter. You know, it's almost like doing some sort of weird algebra, getting the right algorithm of people in. So that last five minutes of the fourth quarter, you could have your best kids in to perhaps have a chance to win the game if that's what your goal is. So don't get it twisted. Don't take it out on the kids. Um, just keep on coaching. Make up your lineup. Make up your rotation in whatever sport you're doing. Coach up the kids that are there. Stay up. Stay positive. And do that for yourself. Do that for your own children. Do that for the kids on your team. And do a good job. So don't be one of those bad youth coaches who gets all bent out of shape and takes it out on the child. that They're just a child. They're under 18. So it's you can't do that to people. Anyway, like, share, subscribe, and comment. My book link is below. My parents sometimes act like idiots when it comes down to coaching kids. And my book got a lot of stories and tips on uh, ways to help you avoid any kind of uh, <laughs> mental dysfunction that you, you may experience while people are trying to be dysfunctional towards you. Anyway, have a great day. Thanks for checking out this video.